Yeah, I remember it. Uh, we preparing our little ADE party. It's now one month until the ADE show. We basically built a smaller version of the stage design. We're programming lights, lasers, visuals. We're actually in the middle of the process of creating the visuals and seeing how they look on the screens. Getting there, it's gonna be really sick. Louis just showed up. Hola. Wait, well, I brought a special outfit. I've been looking forward to this week for a long, long time. The preparation that went into this week compared to any other show, is, it's, it's not even fair, it's not comparable. It's there, we've been talking uh, over a year ago about a whole new concept, new visuals, new lights, and we want to do a concept-related show, and we want to take it to the next, next level. How do you see the lasers hang here, man? There are also these things behind. Here, we have 12 lasers. That's normal. And by AD, we have 30. It's so sick. I can here really give a nice face. Oh, jongen, ja, dat is echt wel wat. Er kunnen wat mensen uithouden. <laughs> dat is geen grap, hè? So, Louis, how much do you love lasers? How much does your camera love lasers? I, I burned four sensors this summer. <laughs> Because of Gabe. Fuck off! <laughs> I warned you once, and then you after show were like, dude, I burned a camera. I'm like, yo. <laughs> It's crazy if I look at all the progress Gabe has made, all the progress Lorenzo has made, all the progress I have made. We as a team have grown so much and we've all grown towards this moment, I feel like. And we're doing two nights at the Rye again, but we've really, really worked our asses off. We've had five more weeks of just programming and rehearsing. This is art. The complimentary and the textures, it's just, oh, it's gorgeous. This is art. Yeah, 100%. It's all making sense now with the music, with the visuals, with the lights, with the lasers. Our show is very futuristic and it's the first time we actually have a theme to our show. We are giving our show a name. Team Garrix presents Anima. So for this show, what separates it from Martin Garrick's previous Martin Garrick shows is that we are presenting a concept as a whole. We're telling a story. So we are clean slating and wiping everything that we've ever done out and starting with a blank canvas. And so what we're deciding to tell and the story that we're telling is about an artificial intelligence becoming conscious and transcending out of the computer realm into the real world. And the show is the journey of our being. And the being's name is Anna, and the show's name is Anima. This is really sick. It's the first time I see this one, I love it. The show is called Anima, it means soul. And it's about artificial intelligence. It's about a computer waking up, self-aware, and analyzing the world, exploring the world. Uh, me and Gabe wrote down a backstory to give it a good context to think about how the show would flow. So we divided this in a few chapters that are called Consciousness, Void, Transcendence and World. And these uh, four chapters talk about the story of this being, this digital being initially that classifies, as, a, as a AI does, classifies objects, um, websites, people, understands how things work and, and compares these things inside its brain. It will transcend and there's a void and then it will leave the computer and it's in the real world. And, and it's a journey we want, we want to tell and take people on. It's going to be integrating the show on the side uh, screen basically where we're going to have the cameras and as well this 3D, 3D representation of Mark in plane basically. Look it's a snake! We have the whole concept about AI, artificial intelligence and we're doing the bylaw EP during Amsterdam Dance event. The first song will be Breach, second one will be Yottabyte, third one will be Latency, fourth one will be Access and then the last one will be Waiting for Tomorrow. And I'm excited to release all those songs. Waiting for Tomorrow is my number one requested song to release and now we're finally going to release it so I'm really excited about that. The music videos are going to be sick because Damien is going to do them. 
Damien came up with the whole concept for the music videos. So it all ties in together with the show, with the concept and with the story we're trying to tell. Damien's gonna do five video clips in two weeks. He's yeah, gonna, gonna sleep. Oh, no, no way, but then it's start of ADE, so. I'm gonna sleep in November, it's fine. This is the, I think the craziest shoot we've done so far in my life. You're gonna see it later on, but this is just the beginning of it and just, it's, it's crazy. We've got like one week and like 12 days until the release of the first one. So, uh, yeah, long days, not a lot of sleep, but uh, once it's there, I think everyone's gonna be really excited. So I'm really happy where this is going. Special thing for me about this video as well is just about like we got all a lot of fans sending in their footage on the screens, which they're gonna be shown in the video as well. We had a long night yesterday, until like 5 in the morning. It was the first part of the shoot and today we're doing the other one. And Martin is here and Blindness is here. So, uh, yeah, we got like six models, two dancers, two DJs, and our main guy. So we like a big crew today. I think we're like with 30 people even, so it's pretty crazy. We have to the show again. Go ride, the Yeti flow not go to the show. Then 4 long on the flight, it's almost dead. Then 12 on the flight. Waar moet je nu gaan? Of nee, maar hoe lang heb je nodig? Want ik kan ook nu naar de studio, heb ik twee uur nodig per uur. Als het mee zit sneller. Wat als we move lunch? Lunch? Nou ja, we doen het Of we move it, we break after this shot. Oké. And then we move everything 30 minutes forward. I have to go to the studio because uh, the deadline for the masters is also tonight. So I have to render two more masters, send them to the label, and then I come back here to shoot the music video for those songs. Can I blindish my name? Over uh, three, four minutes, yeah. Yeah. Okay, where is my Oscar? You're gonna yes. go? And I'll see you guys later. So we move everything we should break now. Hey, blinders. Gabe. Oh, dude, what's up? Gabe, blinders. Hey, what's going on? I'm good. Yeah. Awesome. Today, I finally finished the music for ADE. Lots of new music. And then after this, I go back to the video shoot. Otherwise, Damien gets a heart attack. I'm right now still living in my jet lag, so that's good. Hopefully, I fall asleep at like four or five a.m. But then I wake up tomorrow. With no worries on my head, except the whole ADE show. But at least I delivered the masters. Life is crazy. What are you guys working on? Uh, I'm gonna bounce out all the masters, and uh, Matthias is gonna help me as my second pair of ears. Amazing. Because I've been hearing these songs for over and over again. You have really dark screen. Yeah, I can Do you see something. something. No, I can't. I'm blind. That's so Can't horrible. See anything. Off we go. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so fucking tired. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs>
Dia. Fuck, what's up? Wat een fonteintje.